Rockin' with that chest, not Jeffers TV, cake ass. Now, Rich. Lil' Bill, showin' 20s on Pirelli skills. Got your bitches dilated like the mixed fields. No time to stop, focus on that on the meal. So, man, uh, more bad things going on with Chicago Bears. They already look like they sorry, and they're gonna be sorry as hell this year. Top that off. Somebody broke into their field, their stadium, uh, Soldier Field, and stole $100,000 worth of maintenance equipment. Yeah, man, it says uh, a Soldier Field manager and staff member said one or more burglars tore down a security fence overnight Wednesday and drove multiple pieces of equipment out of a garage, including gators and lawnmowers. So, Damn, somebody towed down a fence. Man, that sounds like some inside shit. Now, I don't, I, don't, I don't mean that by saying somebody that worked there stole it, but maybe somebody that worked there gave out the info of how to get in there and where the equipment was. Because who the hell know, who the hell that don't work there know where they keep that shit at? You know what I'm saying? And how to get to it and all that shit right there, man. Like, come on, man. Like I say, burglary aside, they have struggled mightily on the field. Going 0 and 2. If I they had probably gonna go 0-3 this week. You know what I'm saying? But uh damn bro. That's cold bloody, man. I actually know somebody who coached for the Bears, went to school with him. His name Richard Hightower. He a uh special teams coordinator. Special teams coordinator or special teams coach. But goddamn, man, the Bears, they stand in the news for all the wrong reasons. First, it was uh, Justin Fields talking about he playing robotic because of the coaching staff. <laughs> then they had a thing talking about that it was an FBI raid at, at the damn uh, stadium and shit. Then I think they, uh, they defensive coordinator or something like that resigned. He quit. Cause he said he having health, he having come, you know, he having health complications and shit. So he didn't quit. And now they getting burglarized. Like goddamn Chicago, man, y'all need to get y'all shit together over there. And how the hell somebody tied on a security gate? But uh, shit, the only, only way I know they could do that, what, what they must have hooked the chain up to the gate and and snatched it out with a truck or or what? Like how can they get in the security gate? And you know they must have stole like uh, you know them little. Them little riding, uh, like golf cart type of things that they got. They probably stole some of them. Man, them things, that could get expensive, man. Them things, then they're like $10,000 or some shit like that. A good one, you know what I'm saying? Then the lawnmowers, you know they got to have some big-ass lawnmowers to cut their football field. They probably got some tractors. They probably got a tractor. They damn sure got some zero-turn uh, lawnmowers. And now them lawnmowers, about five, six thousand dollars $6,000 a piece. And... And the tractors, you know, they cost more than that. So, yeah, they got hit, man. Somebody, whoever took that equipment, gonna, gonna make a nice little piece of change out for it. If they saying it was a hundred thousand worth of worth of equipment stole, it probably was about sixty thousand worth. You, you, you know, they gonna tack on more for the insurance. They probably hit it for about sixty thousand dollars, seventy thousand dollars worth of shit. You know what I'm saying? But hey man, y'all better get some goddamn security over there. And, and that is Chicago. Don't forget. Shit, it is Chicago. You know it goes down in Chicago. Shit. Y'all better get y'all shit together over there at Soldier Field. The Bears ain't gonna look good this year. They had might win two, three games. I don't know, man. But anyway, man, it's been bothering the mix, man. Boy, OGBC, we out.